Guy Delosier, Senior Applications Engineer at Go Engineer. This quick tip video is about new whole wizard functionality in SolidWorks 2020. We've got a couple new things here that makes the definition of the depth of the hole more flexible. If I go here and edit the feature that I've already got, the hole that I've got here, we can see that everything looks to be the same except way down here in the bottom I've got a couple new icons that weren't there before. Depth up to shoulder and depth up to tip. The end conditions have not changed. They're the same. And I've specified, I've got two holes in this model here. Both of them are specified to one inch. One of them for depth up to shoulder, the other one for depth up to tip. So if I close this and turn this around so I can see both of my holes and edit the sketch that I've got done here, I can see here that I've got one inch dimension over here on the left and one inch dimension over here on the right. The one on the left, the definition is depth up to shoulder. This one on the right, the same one inch is depth up to tip. So it goes clear to the point of the drill bit. So that makes it nice if you got some thin material and you want to make sure that you don't break through. This one, I can specify the depth up to shoulder and then I'll know about how many threads I can get on there if this was going to be a threaded hole. That's the new functionality. Guy Delosier, Senior Applications Engineer, Go Engineer.